Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Troy Allen Gallat. Welcome to Trigger Time TV brought to you by Crossbreed Holsters. Today the Yeti is joined by Charles Sumner of Glock. They're going to talk about the two hottest firearms in the, in the gun world today. That's the Glock 42 and the Glock 43. Hey guys, Steve Fisher from Sentinel Concepts here today. Talking with my good friend Charles from Glock about the Glock 42 and the new hotness, which is a lot hotter than Pascagoula, Mississippi right now, the Glock 43. Hi guys, I'm from Glock and most everyone knows is watching this program that it, Glock is a major factory in the United States as far as we have 65% of the law enforcement business as far as 65% of law enforcement officers carrying our pistol. Uh, we came out, you know you're familiar with most of our models, but we came out in, at the SHOT Show in 2014 with a, our smallest gun at that point ever, which was the Glock 42 in 380 caliber. The Glock, Glock 42 holds six rounds, has one in the chamber, has the Gen 4 texture on it, has a little bit larger mag catch, has a double recoil spring and is a really fun gun to shoot. Uh, it took off real big in the commercial market and also in the law enforcement market. It's a, it was very anticipated and, and it's been very well uh, accepted. And we also know that the, everybody has been waiting on a single stack nine. And at the NRA show this year, we came out with the G43 which is a single stack nine millimeter. It's slightly longer and slightly larger than the 42, just very slightly. It also holds six in the magazine, one in the, uh, one in the chamber. And it also has the Gen 4 texture on the grip, a larger magazine catch and a double recoil spring. And is a really, uh, with the double recoil spring, has a real light recoil for a nine millimeter that small. Yeah, one of the things, Charles, that we talked about earlier when we were shooting these guns is some of the features on the 43. Again, we mentioned the Gen 4 texture, the oversized magazine release, standard Glock sights, and I know that Glock night sights are going to become available for it here shortly. Right. Uh, to me, the, the, the Glock 43 is pretty much the ideal small concealment kind of carry gun. Uh, you know, even in a backup gun role for law enforcement, uh, smaller stature shooters, but even for somebody my size with large hands, I, I find that with, with the beaver tail in there, I'm able to get behind the gun pretty well. I don't get as much of the Glock slide bite, so to speak, that everybody's talked about over the years, especially with guys with really big hands like myself. Right. Uh, it's a really comfortable gun to shoot, and I was really surprised by the accuracy of it. For being a small gun, most people take into consideration that either they're used to having a gun with non-usable sights, not a very good working trigger, but what we've come to find out is, you know, Glock Perfection has all the above and makes a gun very shootable and very usable. And, and we're seeing, you know, with a change of, to nine millimeter sort of across the country, one of the things that, uh, that the law enforcement agencies have been waiting on is so they can purchase this gun as a backup gun if they're already holding uh, or carrying nine millimeter, uh, the Glock 17 or 19 so forth, they can have one ammo and this is a backup gun and that's all they have to have yeah. is one ammo for the gun. Even if it's something that's gonna be issued or talked to like, you know, the detective bureau guys who wanna just carry a smaller gun, they don't really need to carry a full size duty pistol, not doing SWAT operations. You know, the 43 fits that role as well for them, giving them, again, just a good compact package that will be able to do good work for them. All right, so first magazine through the Glock 43, pretty comfortable, definitely shootable. You saw there, I kind of got on the trigger a little bit hard on that first shot and dropped one. That's life, I'm not a machine, I'm human. It's gonna happen no matter who you are. It's what you do with the subsequent, sh uh, the subsequent shots that really make the difference. So here we go, we'll add in a few more exercises. We'll talk about some failure drills again, possibly. We're just shooting the gun, having a good time with it right now.
Glock 43, not a bad gun. Hi guys, I'm fixing to fire six rounds of Federal HST through the Glock 43 to let you see what the recoil does. Charles, great time having you here. Appreciate everything you've done. Glock 43, great pistol. Definitely going to be one of my new go-tos. Again, remember guys, you are responsible for your own personal safety. Trigger Time TV is brought to you by Troy Defense, BCM, Bravo Company USA, Lucid Optics, Drago Gear, Trigger Tech, Primary Weapon Systems, EOTech, Mayflower Research and Consulting, Wiley X, and Summit Ammunition.